back out here just so it takes more baits out. I'll just run through the setup that we're using today. We've got 550 pound mono, about 10 feet of it. Eight ounce spider weight for these to, um, to break away rocks. Just find they're easier to slide. Crimp to 500 pound cable, about three feet of it. You need at least three feet or else the shark's mouth is gonna just cut you off. It's happened before. Finally, a 16 knot circle hook. We always use circle hooks to safety the shark and it's easier. The shark just gets hooked in the corner of the mouth. Easy to de-hook, easy to release, it's safe for everybody involved. So we're gonna take this bait out about 350 yards and let's see if we can get some sharks. Fish. Look at this. It's a hell of a run. This is a, I think he just woke up. Yeah. This is a pretty good fish. Jeez. We didn't even know we had a shark on at first. And it didn't, we didn't even think it was anything. And then it just woke up and it's been going crazy since then. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely putting up a little bit of a bite. Uh, <sighs> 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 you guys are eating us and sinking. probably a six and a half, seven foot shark, a bull shark on spinning tackle. I mean, it's not a huge bull shark, but any shark that's 175, 200 pounds of bull shark on spinning tackle, tons of fun, great night of shark fishing, and see you next time.